What's going on everybody? My name is Lex Disick and today we are going to be playing a little bit of Subnautica. So, pretty much to start off with this game, um, <laughs> I, I love this game. I love this game so much. It's, it's, it's such a good depiction of what ocean and aquatic life is like. Uh, it's terrifying, it's beautiful, uh, it's got a very, very engaging story. Um, with this playthrough, I'm not going to be going into a lot of the lore, and uh, I will be playing on a controller. So, without further ado, let's get started. I will, I, I, I've played this game one time before, and I didn't finish it. I didn't finish this game. I had a lot of fun, I learned a lot of things, died a lot of times, but I did not finish it. So, this time, I'm gonna start a new game. And as much as I love to play a hardcore game, actually I have no idea if I'd love to play a hardcore game. I love it up until the moment where I died and then lost everything, and then I would just absolutely hate it. So, we're gonna jump into a survival game. And go into the loading screen. Yeah, uh, I'd love to play hardcore, but I'm just not good enough. And the thing is, in this game, you you die so quickly. You know, if if you run out of oxygen, you know, one time, that's it. You're done. It's it's restarts the game. So I don't know. I, I just don't think it would be good. <laughs> All right, let's jump into it. Audio is so good. Like the bass on that explosion is just fantastic. Oh! Oh, my face! Oh, my beautiful face! Why? Alright, and we wake up. Let me out of here! Let me out of here! There's a fire. I'm about to cook. And there starts the raging dubstep. Let's go! The roof is on fire! The roof's on fire! Okay, the roof's not on fire, but... It was getting hot in here for a moment. And I'd, I'd take off all my clothes if I had any clothes, but... I've not, I haven't built the diving suit yet. Well, no, I have clothes. I have clothes on. You have suffered minor head trauma. This is considered an optimal outcome. All right. This PDA has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Uh -huh. Good luck. All right. So here's our PDA. We've got our inventory and all this good informative stuff here. Excellent. I agree. I agree. Well, I mean, not ideal, but we're alive. And minor head trauma as an optimal outcome, that's great. We could have exploded. We could have exploded. So, so we've got a broken radio. We'll need a repair tool to get that up and running. And then also secondary systems, which I have no idea what that is in charge of. Looks like everything's okay. Alright, so... Let's see where we ended up. Oh. Hello, creature. Oh, again. The base. The base, it's so good. The Aurora suffered orbital pile failure. Cause unknown. Zero human life signs detected. Does, does, does that mean, does that mean I'm not human? What's going on here? 
So there's the Aurora, the ship, and here's the endless, horrible, just not good <laughs> ocean. Look at that. That is... That's, <laughs> the isolation and just nothingness of, of this here. Eh, makes me sick to my stomach, to be honest. Yeah, I, I'm probably going to have to not look at that anymore. Let's... Uh, Let's use a health kit before we go anywhere. Because I'm going to try my hardest to not die at all through this playthrough. I say that now, but I know it's... It could be bad. Okay. Alright. So, let's go for a swim, I guess. You know? Subnautica. Need to go under the water. There I am. And there is the ocean. Okay, welcome to the underwater life. First things first, I guess we're gonna go ahead and just gather a whole bunch of resources. I don't have anything specific in mind that I'm trying to build first. Let's just see what's available to us. Definitely, definitely grab some bladder fish here. New creature discovered. Hello, don't look at me like that. Okay. Alien life forms may have unexpected applications. Utilizing alien resources is a prudent survival strategy. Uh -huh. Copper is an essential component of all powered equipment. Your probability of survival Great has just increased like to unlikely, but plausible. Cool. Oxygen. Oh no. Alright. So here it begins. I'm already almost drowning. Also, there's no indication of when you're about to run out of oxygen in hardcore mode, and that's how I know I drown. I would drown so much because I I don't watch that. Hello, what's through here? Cool. All right, grab some mushrooms. Delicious. Actually, you probably wouldn't want to eat those. Oh, titanium wreckage. The metal salvage is wonderful for titanium. And we're gonna need food. We're gonna need a lot of food, so I'm gonna go chase some fishies. Come here. New peeper. Discovered. Hello, peeper. Oh, hello. What do we have here? Oh, I need a scanner. Okay. Aha! So that was a sea, a sea glide fragment, which will greatly increase my swim speed if I build it and use it. Gary fish, I'll take you. Bladder fish. This is going to be my early source of water. Drinkable water, that is. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Oh, really? I didn't grab a single one there? Oh, I'm coming for you. Go! I... Uh, uh. Come here! It's so hard to grab fish at the beginning. I don't have any swim fins. I don't have a sea glide. Um, let's grab some of those creep creep vine clusters here or seeds oh seed clusters New blueprint acquired. those will take up a lot of space in my inventory I think yeah they do okay we'll only grab a couple then that's fine that's fine come here come here come on I'm hungry please I can't there's there's no there's no McDonald's anywhere around here. I, I eat something. I was I was gonna do that. Thank you, thank you, random floating floating English instructions. I appreciate it. Okay, yeah, let, let's let's cook something up here. This is as close as it gets to Long John Silver's. 
the fabricator cooks small organisms while disposing of the skeletal structure, bodily fluids, and internal organs, thus rendering them safe for human consumption. When you explain it like that, it really this doesn't make me want to eat it. Synthetic foods to be repulsed by eating an animal carcass. Remember that humans survived this way for millennia. Oh. You can too. Yeah, I remember. I remember eating and stuff, you know. I'm gonna uh, save these nutrient blocks because they provide a lot of food, whereas the fish don't provide as much food. So if I'm on like a big adventure or something, I, I, I'm gonna take the nutrient blocks with me rather than um, just having fish in my inventory. And I'll keep that one, I guess. The food does decompose in this game the longer you have it in your inventory, and I'm pretty sure if I were to put it into storage, um, it would decompose as well. So yeah, I'm gonna actually throw those nutrient blocks in there, and I'll drink some water. Okay, so we got a little bit of the mushrooms. I believe their only use is for batteries. They might have a couple other uses, but I know that I know they're used for batteries for sure. I can count on that. Haha! -ha! A better oxygen tank. That is extremely necessary. It's so necessary. And there's our swim fins, so we can catch some fishies a little easier. Alright, thanks for keeping me safe. Hey, actually, we could get a scanner right now if we built a battery. Seems like a fair trade to me. Alright. So yeah, this scanner tool is going to be extremely, extremely important in... Yeah! Yeah, it took the words right out of my mouth. Thank you, Alexa. Following the massacre on Braxis Prime. The knife remains the only exception. Okay, so we got a knife, and we got our scanner tool. Um, yeah, I'm probably just gonna try to get as many tools as I can done right now, and that'll hopefully make everything in the future a lot easier for me. Um, yeah, the, the math checks out on that, I'm, I'm pretty sure. An air bladder flotation device, I'm not gonna need that until I go deeper. Habitat Builder, that is that is what I want. I want one of those. So, we need a, another battery. Uh -huh. Some glass, which I think I need quartz for. And then sulfur, titanium, gold, silver, all that, all that great stuff, you know. Ah, and I know how to cure things now. So it won't go bad. <laughs> but the nutrient blocks, I'm pretty sure, stay good for a long time. Okay, so let's drop off everything that we got that we don't need right now. So you go, you go. Um, I'm just going to keep this stuff in here right now. And let's go scan that fragment of the, um, the sea glide. Oh no. Oh no, it's getting dark out. Yeah, this game is scary in the daytime, but when it gets nighttime, it's <laughs> it's just a whole other beast. All right. Uh what are you? Gravity trap. All right. That'll help me catch fish even better, right? Right? Okay. Can't go in there yet. I'm definitely gonna scan this. Um, oh, we're good on oxygen. I don't need to come up yet, but. Oh, man, and the colors. Seriously. The waves, like all of it. Oh, gosh. It's beautiful. It's so pretty. 
Okay, anything in here? No. Okay. Oh, what's going on down there? Uh, oh, 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 okay, alright, yeah. <laughs> you take, take your time, <laughs> take your time on that. I'll, I'll just wait over here. I saw some, oh, okay, that's hot, that's, that's pretty warm. Um, yeah, I'll just, I'll just stay away from that for now. Alright, so we are looking for limestone deposits and sandstone deposits if I can find them but I have a feeling the sandstone deposits are oh a swivel chair God, <laughs> that's what I was looking for this is what I've needed I have come all this way the, the first thing I knew I should have done as soon as that escape pod landed was look for a swivel chair how could you live without one how okay beacons those will be handy and this should finish up my grab trap. Ha <laughs> ha! The more you learn, the more you earn. <laughs> right? Maybe? Something? Out of the sort? That's fine. We'll go, we'll go off that assumption. Oh, whoa! Flying peepers! Where'd you guys learn to fly? Oh. Boomerang. If only I could throw those guys around underwater and they come back to me. <laughs> Using live fish as weapons. Yeah, uh, I'm not so sure that would be an effective strategy, but it's something I'd pay to watch. Easy. If it worked. I don't think it worked. Okay, so let's go a little bit deeper over here and see if we can't find some of the sandstone deposits. Getting a lot of copper and titanium, which is great and all, but I need to be finding the sandstone deposits. I don't know exactly where those are. But I need that, because that's where I'm going to get my gold and my silver. And my useless lead as well. Nearly. Nearly useless. Whoa. Excuse you. Gosh. Sea creatures, you know? Sometimes sometimes they lack a little bit of manners. But that's okay. We love them all the same. I'm not 100%. I've taken one course in whale before, um, but I'm not. I'm not completely fluent. You know, I picked up a lot of what I knew from uh, D Dory. Are you Dory? No. Oh, that's. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> that is something that wants me dead. Okay, I'm at half. I am at half health. I yeah 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 yeah. Okay, so those are the crashes. And that's where I get my sulfur, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Holy crap, though. Half dan- Like, I'm at half health right now. That's... From one of those. One of those got me to half health. That's like... That's terrifying. Oh. Okay, that was strange. Alright, I'll take one of you. But yeah, like I was saying, Dory taught me a little bit. Um, pretty much got me into it. Don't, please don't, please don't. Go, go up. No. Oh. Oh. oh my god. There's bad things. There's bad things all around. I'm getting out. I'm getting out. Sorry. Okay, yeah, he wants me dead. Please don't kill me. <laughs> Is he still following me? Are you still following me? Oh my gosh. Alright, yeah, we're gonna have to watch it a little bit, because I am... I am still at half health. Sandstone... No, no, no. Okay, so I was able to avoid that one. 
Let's go see where... You know what? You know what? Here, did, no. Have a flare, have a flare. Go, go, go. What? It didn't work here. Here, see the, see the flare? Go get the flare, go. I, did I drop that or throw that? I don't know. There, you just have fun. 30 seconds. Gosh, I don't have a sea glide or anything, so I can't really get away from these guys quickly. Alright, we're... Oh, oh. 270 meters. I'm kind of a little, a little... I'm a little bit out here, aren't I? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ew. I don't want anything to do with that. Sorry, my man. Alright, sure. I mean, I'm gonna need some more food and water later, so if it's right there, why not grab it? Um. Oh, okay, yep, 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 yep. I just wanted to peek. Okay, that wasn't... It looks like the damage on those guys depends on how close you are to them, and I see another one right there. Come on out. Come on out. Don't be shy. Oh, what? Boy! The guy was not shy at all. <laughs> he just was waiting for an excuse to just barge out of there. <laughs> Why are they so eager to explode? Like, seriously. Okay, so. Repair tool. I'll take it. Yes, flashlight. Give me one of those so I can survive the very, very dark nights and the bad, bad deep down where light doesn't touch the bottom of the ocean. I have a survival knife. And I really, really need to figure out the ingredients to my, my um, sea glide there. We won't need any beacons for a while. A waterproof locker. That might help for extra storage. Yeah, it's just titanium. Why not? Why not? We'll get a locker outside. I don't think you can deploy those inside. Um, so, the habitat builder. Alright. Yeah, the sandstone deposits. That's... that's What's going to help us do that? Still haven't found any of those. Have not found a single sandstone deposit. And... Oof. Old boomerang. You know, I'm not really one for letting food go to waste, so, uh, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna stomach this one. Oh, oh, crunch, crunch. Oh, no. Oh, it's old. Vital signs. Oh. Stabilizing. But hey, wait, does that hurt me? No, it doesn't hurt me. That's good. I feel like there should be more repercussions for eating old, cooked food. I know it's not going to do anything for me, but I'm just going to eat it all anyway because it's going to go bad. Alright, so there's my, my agua. Okay, we're looking good. And do we have another med kit that we can use because... One more, one more good blast from a crash, and that's all it would take to take me down. Okay. Excellent. Um. Alright, so, we got... Here's my flashlight. Yeah! My <laughs> hair dryer slash flashlight. And... Aha! Repair tool. Can I use this to fix my life? I think I can. I think I can. Oh my gosh. It has telekinetic abilities. Guys, this is space age technology here. Those are good sounds. Those are good sounds. Alright. So we got our secondary systems online. Still don't know what that does, but that's excellent. And, yeah. Uncharted planet. Mm. So we are the first 
to be discovering this planet. That's also a really cool thing. Oh, a message for me? What you got? Oh, yeah. There's too many people talking. Right. So, I don't think 999 nine, repeating hours is going to be... I don't think that's going to be um, anytime soon at all. So, yeah, we're probably, probably on our own on this one. So... Oh, oh, self-scan. I don't think I've done that yet. Hey, hey! Vital signs, normal. I'm normal. Continuing wow. That's great, great news, I think. Oh, wonderful. Okay. So. Alright, I am going to... Where... I, I, just wherever I can go. I'm, I'm headed directly for those sandstone deposits and what what's going on here flutter huh hmm can I can I use the... oh okay so I can pick them up uh -huh. <laughs> oh I have the power I have the power to float things I wonder if I could put this on like a a creature. Can I can I put you? I can. I can attach it to things. I wonder if there's an actual application for that 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 would be useful. I don't know. Okay. So I will deploy this this locker here. Oh, what did I do? Did I deploy it? I deployed it. Okay, sweet. All right. So we got a little bit of just a small amount of extra storage, but a little bit can go a long way. All right. So we're going to head straight for... Oh, there's some other floaters. What are you guys doing? Here, here. here. Oh, I'll help you. I'll help you. Looks like your buddies are working on this project with this rock here. Does that help? I hope that helps. All right, not sure what I did there or why I did it, but I did it, so it's done. Can't be taken back. And there is a sea glide fragment. Yes, now I can figure out what I need to do to make one of those. Not 100% sure yet, but when I get back to um, home base, I'll, uh, I'll figure that out. Continued degradation of the auroras. The music Drive is court. great. May result in a quantum detonation. I love this Continuing game. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's what I've been looking for right there. Hello, hello, silver ore. Silver based wiring kits are an essential component of many habitats. Is there any brain coral down here? Um, I'm at like half oxygen. I need to find some brain coral, coral down there so I can do a little bit more exploring and not have to go all the way back up and all the way back down. And I think I can get some samples off this creep vine too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello? Yep. Cool. Take a couple of those. Just trying to get as much as I can diversity wise. Uh, for resources. Is that? No. Nope. Not sandstone. Limestone. That's fine. I guess... It doesn't matter how much, um... Titanium I get. Oh, sea moth fragments! This is a little early to be finding one of these, but... I'll take it. I'll go the other way. Not, not interested. Not interested. Not interested in the cave. Although, I should probably keep that in mind. Is that a po possible cave opening? 
nearby. So, where am I in relations to... Okay, so I'm in between... Can I just sit on the surface for a little bit? Thank you. Alright, so I'm in between the Aurora and... my home base. Sorry, the audio cut out there for a little bit. Alright. Oh, is that what you mean? I'm pretty sure that's what it means. Hello. Gold. Yes, gold. Hmm. <sighs> Love me some gold. What is this? I'm not even going to try to pronounce that. I can pronounce Violet, but, um... I don't know, sometimes words get me. Uh, I'll give it a shot. Biaw! Violet, biaw! What a, what a beautiful undersea plant. Okay, so yeah, that that's just, that's, a, that's a definite no. That is a definite no. I, I'll just take a hard, hard pass on that one. This thing shoot at me, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know how. It's very impressive for a, a life form, like for a plant. It's like if Venus flytraps had sniper rifles. Oh, there we go. Okay, so I'm in the right place. Great. Great, great, great. Ah, I'll go for some metal salvage. Uh, uh, I just wanted the metal salvage. I didn't want nothing to do with you, Sand Shark. Gosh, you're wild. Oh, okay. All right, I'm backing up, backing up, backing up. I really thought that guy was gonna eat me. Thirty seconds. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, back up to the surface. Still no brain coral. But that's alright. This is doable. I know. I'm almost there. Fun way to play this game would be if you actually held your breath every time. <laughs> that would not be. Don't listen to me. That would not be fun. That would not be safe. It would. <laughs> no. No. Never mind. Just, just forget I even said anything about that. No immediately reject that idea. Alright. Uh, Thank you. Thank you. It is my favorite. I, I love to do nothing more than just swim around. All the time. All day long. Even during nighttime. Swimming. Just lots of swimming. Just keep, you know... To quote Dory again, just keep swimming. She was right. She couldn't have been more right when she said just keep swimming. All right, so um, there's a couple more tools I can make. A battery. All right, I need a battery. Um, please tell me I have one more. I do. Exactly one. Wait. That's my inventory. Um, I need two, right? Two, two acid mushrooms for a battery? That's okay, because they're right here. I wonder if my power recharges during the night time. I, th I wonder if it's just, it looks to me like it's probably solar energy. I don't know, maybe it does recharge at night. All right, got a battery. And I think that's gonna be enough to get our habitat builder. It is, it is. Okay, so, yeah, we have pretty much all of these things. Um, I'm not going to go ahead and get a Pathfinder tool. I know that could help in caves a lot, but I feel like my own instinct is going to be good enough. Yeah, watch me die in the future for that. And... Okay, I don't know. I, I don't have enough silver ore to make the high capacity tank, but I will definitely be getting on that very very soon. Um, all right, so we have our habitat builder slash razor 
<laughs> it looks like a razor. Man, those guys at those guys at Altair really, really knew what they were doing, making a habitat builder slash razor. Like I'll never I'll never have to uh, worry about cutting myself with my survival knife ever again, you know? It's just good. It's good. Uh, ingenuity at its finest. Okay, so what's this message? What do we got? What? This is LifePod 3, uploading our hey. coordinates. We're plugging some holes in our emergency sea glide, so if we're late for the rendezvous, don't panic. Also, don't go home without us. Seriously. Three out. All right, we'll, we'll do that. All righty, so I think I'm going to call that an episode. Um, thank you, everybody, for watching. This game is awesome, and there's just so much more to do. There's a long way to go. We are merely at the beginning, and I'm having a lot of fun with it. So um, thank you, everybody, for watching. Don't forget about the like button, subscribe button. And just, yeah, thank you. Have a great day. I will catch you all on the flip side.